Hi folks, I wanted to show you a quick another little video that you can do with OBS and have some fun little effects with it. This one's going to be the recursion effect, which you can kind of set up with lots of different things in different ways and different styles and things like that to give you that trippy, weird little vibe that you can kind of make with different streams. Now, it might not be my personal set of things, but I know a lot of people can do it. This was a very easy way to do it with OBS, and I'll show you how to do it today. Let's go get started. Hi folks, welcome to our YouTube series. Here I take a look at anything we can do to help you out on stream, whether it's visual audios or even brand. I'm your stream champ, The Argument Mock. Just a couple of quick things to get out of the way. Um, if you haven't done so already, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. We'll have more information coming to help you out on your stream. Um, I also stream quite often on Twitch myself. You're welcome to jump in, ask any sort of OBS related questions or even game with me. It's always a good time. And we just recently opened up a small spot in our Discord for any sort of OBS tech related questions. So if you don't see me online at the moment and you just had a couple quick things you want to run by me, whether it's like, hey, hey, Arg, is this a cool idea or how could I do this type of thing? You're welcome to drop them down in the Discord. Join our community of awesome streamers and we can try to help you out there as well. And you'll probably get some personal responses from me. Even if you don't have to feel like commenting on the YouTube side of thing, you can jump in Discord and ask away. We're trying to help each other build our brands and that's the whole idea with that said let's go ahead and jump into obs itself and take a look at how to set this up today okay i'm over in on our stream pc side of things and the first thing you're going to need to do is grab this plugin itself pretty simple it's this plugin video um you need to download it grab the os that is appropriate for you we have win32 64 linux Download the appropriate one. It comes in a, a zip folder. So if you go into my downloads, I have one downloaded over here. And then you'll see these two files. After you extract it, copy those files. Find where your OBS has installed to. For me, it's my C drive and program files in OBS. And then just right click and paste those files right there. I'm not going to pop them in there. They're already running in the background and it will just overwrite everything that needs to overwrite. Pretty simple installation. You're gonna to need to jump in and restart OBS, maybe your computer, depending on your settings. And with that said, your, your plugin should be installed correctly. Um, you'll need to highlight whatever source that you wanna to highlight to get the, the, the thing working. And I'm not gonna lie, this is only really makes sense with cameras and only really makes sense if you have a green screen. Quick little side note, if you do have no green screen and you're looking to try to set up something that's similar, um, you can also use the uh, like the Xbox Connect ca uh, camera with a little bit of bugs and tweaks and actually make that work like a, a green screen thing. It's a little harder to do. The green, skills, the green screen is still probably the way to go, but hey, guess what? If you, if you don't have it, that's an option if you also have that type of hardware. Just a little FYI. So anyways, highlight your cam source after you've already had it chrome and keyed out. Right clicker pop on the filters. I already have one of recursion effect right here, but I'm just going to delete it and I'm going to bring in a new one. So new item, we have a recursion um, effect. You can name it whatever you want. Um, you can set the delay. I, I find that the longer the delays probably works the most, um, probably around 800 seconds or so. You can already see it doing its thing in the background. Um, X offset, Y offset, scale X, scale Y. You can adjust this depending on what you need and what you want to set up. And I think that the scales going up makes the most sense. So I only have it by a couple of metrics and then I usually do a little bit of a negative on X and a little bit of negative on Y. Again, kind of depends on which way you want it to move or crossed and it all kind of works a different way. Um, you can see it, it, it does infinite loops pretty much and it will just keep on going, going, going. Now the cool thing about this little plugin, um, as opposed to doing it the old way, and the old ways you can just duplicate your, your camera multiple times, is this plugin doesn't actually take all that much processing and it kind of does the entire effect for you with just a simple button clicks. So I really like it in that, that term. All right, we also have a reset trigger and this t is what turns off the recursions in the background. And the one that I would recommend, it kind of depends. There's show hide, activate, deactivate, but I like the enable. And that's when this eye icon over here gets toggled off and then back on. It will start from the base again and then start again. And the cool part about this is we can integrate it with Lorian board, very similar to how we've done with one of our other videos. And with Lorian board integration and the eye filter 
being toggled off and on, we could trigger this with just a simple button click on our makeshift stream deck and or something like a channel point redemption, maybe a sub, maybe a bit. You can tie it in together to make this thing work with Lorien board and other triggers. So let's go ahead and close this out real fast and I'll show you kind of how that, that looks. It all depends on what you want to do with it. And if you're into this type of a trippy effect, you're pretty much good to go. So that's it for today's video. Um, I am going to link how to install Lorien board down below. So check that out if you want to see how, because with the Lorien board, you can basically have something like channel points redeem this effect for your chat. Pretty cool, huh? I'll see you glitches on the next video. Be safe out there. I used this work earlier today. What was, okay, what was the, the, the dick, the, uh, <laughs> a dish started with the D, started with the D. Hi, I'm Sarah Jessica. And I'm here waiting for Big. <laughs> the clips.